In this video, we are going to understand about a right angle triangle. You must be wondering what is this so special about a right angle triangle. Let me first draw a triangle. We know a right angle is equal to 90 degree, right? Now, in a right angle triangle, there are certain specific terms that you need to note. The side which is opposite to the right angle, this is my right angle, angle B, and the right angle's opposite side is this, is called the hypotenuse. A very typical kind of a name but yes this is what is called and the other two sides other than the hypotenuse are called the legs of the triangle now what is so special about this hypotenuse and the legs of the triangle what is special here is that in case of a right angle triangle let's say suppose this hypotenuse, the length of hypotenuse is A, the length of this leg is B, the length of this leg is C. Now in a right angle triangle, there is a property which says that, this, that the square of the length of the hypotenuse, so suppose it is A, A square is equal to the sum of the squares of the legs. So sum of the squares of the legs. And what are the legs? Legs, one leg is B, so it is B square, and the second leg is C, C square. So if suppose, let's say, the value of the hypotenuse is say 9, or maybe some other number we can take kind of, you know, let's not take 9. Okay, let's say hypotenuse is equal to 5. So in this case, if the hypotenuse is 5, I mean this is something which I did in my brains and then kind of put it in, this holds true. So there is a right angle triangle which is possible if the hypotenuse is 5 and the legs are 4 and 3 each. Now suppose I was told that the hypotenuse of a triangle is 9 centimeter. Can I have a, can I have a, right angle triangle with legs of 5 and 6. Now if this is the case, if this is the case, then this property has to hold true, which means that 9 square is equal to 5 square plus 6 square. Why? Because if this is a right angle triangle, then the square of the hypotenuse has to be equal to the sum of square of the legs, which means that 81 is equal to 25 plus 36. But we know that this two sum is equal to 61, and hence this is not true. Therefore, there cannot be a right angle triangle whose hypotenuse is 9 and the sides are 5 and 6, respectively. 